What is up YouTube? This is the King Magic Hop and today I have another Wi-Fi battle for you guys. This is against my good friend Ranak and this is go this video is gonna be sped up um just because this battle was ten minutes long. So yeah. Um this will be another Wi-Fi battle. So yeah. I'm gonna lead off with my um my Diggersby as he leads off with his Raikou. So right now he's gonna get the substitute on and he I am going to go for an earthquake just to break the sub because I thought it was obvious that he's gonna go for a sub. So what I do now is I use another earthquake. He goes for the hidden power ice just to get some more damage on me. He loses some um, HP because of the life orb and I use earthquake again. So now he goes into his Guru Ninja. Which I'm scared of the Greninja, so I go into my Rotom, um, predicting the Ice Beam, but he goes for the Grass Knot, which was pretty good prediction, but it does nothing to my Rotom. So right now he's going to um, go into his uh, Bikini, but I Volt Switch out. I go into my Landorus to get that Intimidate drop, and I uh, use Earthquake because it's super effective. So. Now he goes into his Greninja, which I'm scared of now, so because he can use an Ice Beam, so I go into my Rotom um, you know, just to do more damage onto this Greninja and eat up his hits. So now he's going to switch out into his Conkyota, which this was a mistake. I was predicting the Garchomp, but he um, goes for the Conkyota and I activate his guards, which was a mistake. So now I Volt switch it out just to get some damage on him plus I get that switch in initiative and I go into my Landorus just to get the intimidate drop so now he uses a knockoff to knock off my choice scar and now I use earthquake and it finishes off the Conkyota so now I go in, um, he goes into his Greninja as I switch out into my Rotom kind of repetitive but he goes for the Ice Beam because I was predicting the Ice Beam from my Landorus and now he switches out into his Garchomp now I use a Will-O-Wisp because I'm predicting the card Garchomp now and now he gets crippled and now he's going to Mega Evolve into Mega Garchomp so now he's gonna do Outrage which I can eat up it but I'm living I'm just living but the crucial thing is that I miss the Hydro Pump, so now I want to preserve a 6-0, so I switch back into my Glyscore, which can eat up um, a Outrage, because he's a physical wall. So now I get poison because of my Toxic Orb, and now he's Outrage again, because he can't switch out, or he can't choose another move. Now he becomes confused because of due to fatigue, and now I use an Ice Fang, which won't kill, but luckily for me, he was burnt. So that was a good thing on my side that he was burnt. Now he, he goes into his Greninja, which I don't know why he switched, but he went into his Copagrigus. I'm guessing just to get that mummy. Uh, so now I go into my Scizor. I don't want to get the mummy ability, so I Mega Evolve and I U-turn it out just to um, get get mummy and then uh, get uh, switch out so I don't have um, which I have technician now so now I've gone to my glide score just to do some damage onto his copper grievance so now um, I get that poison heal and now I toxic um, this copper grievance just to make him toxic now he does shadow ball it won't it, it does a lot of damage because I'm a defense wall and not a special defense wall so now he gets poisoned and I use an earthquake just to do more damage into onto him and now he goes for another shadow ball which will do more than like half so now I get that poison heal and now he is slowly dying from the poison so now I get the protect and now he gets that leftovers and I get my poison heal which is really good for Glyce Ball. So now he gets poisoned and he's slowly dying as we continue the battle. So I switch into my Digger Speed, predicting the Shadow Ball. So now I am going to do a U turn just to um, get Mummy and switch and have to and get to 
um, switch into any Pokemon I like and adding damage to that. So now I go into my Gliscor, but his um, Will of Wisp fell because I was predicting the Will of Wisp. So now I get the poison heal and he slowly dies from the poison. So now he dies. So now he goes into his Greninja and I go into my Scizor. And now my Scizor can eat up loads of hit because it's an ice type and I'm a steel type since you know steel type is super effective. So he hangs off with that focus sash because um Ranak runs a focus sash. So now he uses the dark pulse which does a lot and I'm just gonna finish him off with a priority bullet punch. So there you go guys I defeated my friend Ranak and yeah thank you guys so much for watching please like comment subscribe all of those good stuff and I will see you later. Bye bye.